It's time. Begin the show. Well, folks, uh, we're not in New York anymore. Um, we're in Plant Fire Department, the simulation. So I guess I, the Drew, the Drew uh, blank lore, I got really bored of driving a bus in New York, and I fell asleep and crashed my bus, and I woke up in Plant Fire Department town, in the front of this out-of-focus, blurry-looking factory. Uh, well, without further ado, I guess, there's not much to, not much to talk about. Let's get started. Do you want to play the tutorial? I probably should do that. Oh! Oh. Let's take a minute. Look at that guy. Hmm. Okay. Good morning. You must be our new colleague. I've been waiting for you. You're lucky that the boss is out for a training course with the majority of our staff today. He would have spent hours showing you around the entire complex. I'm just going to quickly touch on the most important roles. Points. You'll find everything else late yourself later on, so please follow me so we can get through this quickly. <laughs> okay. Press F to continue. That's what you need to pay. Oh! <laughs> Look at that. Oh, wow. Look at that saunter. He. <laughs> You looking like you just walked down a walked down a subway. As you can tell, this is our vehicle hall. The vehicles are kept here when they are not being used, serviced, or washed. <sighs> okay, you'll find everything that is necessary to fulfill your ta our tasks here, from small command post vehicles to fire engines and even the turbo extinguishers. <laughs> okay, bye. What am I following you? What am I doing? Can I go inside the car? No. The car has collision. <laughs> this is another dollar worth of my hard-earned money. <laughs> this walking animation is worth it alone. Just look look at him. Head in the air. <laughs> chest out. <laughs> Hands to his side. Walking. Aqua re oh, uh, aqua refreshing. And there's a picture of one of the developers. Like, put me on there. Put me on there. Come on. Come on, guys who made this game. And I get... Oh, what is that? <laughs> that? That's a horrible monster on that one. Where'd he go? <gasps> oh, no. Uh, He's not down this hallway. Oh, no. Where'd he... Oh! Ah! Oh, what, what was that? The door... The door just kind of opened. <laughs> is he in here? This is the bedroom. Can I steal this guy's purse? Nope. Can't steal the purse. Can I... Oh, is that a camera? Is that a megaphone on tape tape to the wall? What what is this? This is way more in depth than New York Bus Simulator. There's like a environment. Oh ah! <laughs> it's Bigfoot standing there. This is our relaxation room. The single bed here on the right belongs to you. <laughs> That's a piece of cardboard, my boy, with a piece of green on it. Oh, there's more people! Oh! They all have- Oh! Oh! Look at that guy! He's a different walk cycle! <laughs> oh! He looks like he's got a disease. Poor dude. I feel bad for these poor people. We are now at the heart of the fire station. This is our control room. All reports arrive here and all operations are coordinated from here. I still, I can't get over that, I don't know. This is our washing bay and maintenance hall. Every driver is responsible for the condition of their own vehicle. This includes the daily checkup of all functions and the cleaning of the vehicle, of course. Tasks such as vehicle care can normally be done comfortably between operations. Vehicle checks should always be done first in the morning, so you don't have any nasty surprises during, ooh, during an operation. High pressure cleaners can be found on both sides of the hall. If the weather is nice, you can wash your vehicle outside. But if you do, remember that there's a limit to the length of the hose. Th How in-depth is this game going to get? I would like to keep everyone in mind that... Oh, oh, a little fire truck. Ooh, they got a little... <laughs> They're like, alright, guys. Let's build this glass case, right? But put a single children's fire truck toy in it. And that's it. And they're like, Man, you know what? Man, this game really is on the same disc as New York Bus Simulator. 
where I don't do anything. Can I like go in here? Oh wait, E to open. Oh, I open the door. Cool. Can I shut the door? Yeah. All right. This is this is already leaps and bounds more interesting and cool than a bus simulator. What's the vehicle I need to do? Do I have like a mission? Can I like pilot this vehicle? No. Uh, what, which, which one was it? Oh! Whoa! Okay. Oh, okay. Can I like, oh, I gotta open the door first. Wow, all right. So when you get in a car in New York bus simulator, you get nothing, but in this, you do whatever you want. Can I, can I like, this is, this is awesome. I love this. Oh, an alarm has been sounded in zone 10 of pre the plant premises. All alerted units, make your way to there quickly, quickly as possible. All supporting vehicles to report specified assembly areas. All right, here we go, boys, the action. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Move out, move out, come on, come on, come on. Where, how do I get there? Oh, it's on my map. My mini map. I'm on my way. Turn on my siren and my lights. Actually, I'm just gonna turn the siren off because it's really loud and I don't like it. Where's where's the fire? I'm coming for your fire. I'm gonna eliminate you. You're no match for me in my weird little car. Is that? Oh, it's just the factory. Where is the fire? Oh, I see it. It's blinking on my map. Where is? I wonder how the fire looks. For one dollar. I can I can do this. I can make something out of this. This is awesome. Little fun, little fun little game. I'm coming for you, fire. Oh, little, little slap. Slap that fire with my car. Woo, woo. Get the extinguisher. Die. Die. Okay. The fire was fought successfully. The operation there can therefore be signed off and all command post vehicles can return to the station. Please sign off the operation now. How do I how do I do that? I think I did it automatically. All right, we did it. So we fought our successful fire. I hope you enjoyed that episode. No, I'm just kidding. We're gonna keep going. Man, I, this music, like just like just like New York Bus, that had like really calming, like jazzy, swanky music. This has like ethereal, like relaxing yoga music. I, I'm kind of digging it, especially for fighting fires. Oh, man, how am I supposed to be on the edge of my toes while I'm fighting fires like this and it's all just relaxing and kind of chill? <laughs> man, is this gonna like ramp up or is this every is this it? I mean, it's not it's not terrible honestly, but like Where are all the fires at? Ouch slam into the thing Where's where the oh no did I lose the firehouse? Oh, it's over here. I think yeah, it's over here. We good. I kind of like the other view better. What a beautiful little little world we got. We got like... It's like a post-apocalyptic thing where everything is just industrial. And wait a, wait a minute. Now that I'm thinking about it, that fire I put out was not... What am I, what am I stuck on? That fire I put out was not a plant. That was a pallet. I just... The pallet just kind of spontaneously combusted... I just kind of put it out. Where is the firehouse? Is there like a map button? M? Uh, tab? This little button? Nope. Escape? Uh, is there a controls thing? No. Oh no. How do I... Where are the controls at? Alright. We made it back to the firehouse. Safe and sound. Can I drive the big fire truck? Ah! Crash into the building first. And then drive the big fire truck. I want to drive the big fire truck just like when I was a young boy. Just like when I, just like my dreams. Let me in. Give me the fire truck now. Why can't, why, why can't I drive the fire truck? Van? Oh, van? Nope, no van. Do I have to like upgrade my ability? Do I have to like rest? I'm going to rest. Hmm. Can, will they make it out? They've they've settled their differences and escaped. Thank you, sirs. Good good people. Oh, hmm. You can do it. You can do it. Hey, they did it. So they can collide with each other, but I just kind of. Oh, we have a traffic jam again. Oh man, this one's rough. This one's rough. 
Why is this guy wearing red? He's a cut above the rest, I guess. <laughs> oh no! <clears throat> I was just trying to have my lunch. Oh, I gotta go back down. Guys, you guys, come on guys, there's a fire! Let's go. Guys! Guys! There's a fire! Guys, please! Guys, get out of my way! I have to go put out the fire. In my little boy. Can I get in this car? No, I can't. I gotta get my little boy. The little boy! I'm sprinting. Oh, car not looking too hot. Not not looking too hot, honestly. I need to do maintenance on when I get back. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Let's go. Let's go. Don't worry. I'm here to stop the fire. Where is it? Die. Break. Die. I've done it. Oh, it's 6 p.m. Oh, cool. I'm done. Cool, uh, 200 points, my rank, fire, fire candidate, game days one. Successful large scale operations three. That was a large scale operation. Like a piece of trash is caught on fire. You've been tinkering with your vehicle for no reason. We got a, we are not a car tuning company, you know, or do you think it just, it makes the vehicles go any faster? Listen, I just wanted to mess around with my car. What is wrong with you people? I'm gonna save. New name of new save game. Colin Long. That's who I'm playing as. He's like, what's up, fire? I'm Colin Long, and this is Magic Strawberry, a.k.a. my fire extinguisher. Good morning, everyone. As I've got a lot to do myself, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn around and look at the corner. Yeah, like, look at that boss. I'll keep it short and summarize the most important points. What are they? Tell me, now. I'm assigning you the command post vehicle Florian 1 today. Wow, the same vehicle I had yesterday. Thanks. As long as there's nothing else to do, you can get your work on your, we can get to work on your routine, dat, to routine tasks and some training drills. The main thing is that you ensure your vehicle is ready for action. Okay, all right. So I, just need to, I need to fix my vehicle. You know, a dollar, you know, for a dollar a game on that 10 game disc, you can't go too wrong with this one. It's honestly, it's inoffensive at best. Kind of boring at worst, but all in all, I think it was worth it. Like, look at this view. You can't, you can't get enough of that, you know? There's cars, interiors, guys on vending machines making funny, funny faces. I'm gonna, and I'm gonna look at this one. You know, look at that guy. Look at this guy. The inside of this guy's head. You can't get, you can't get this anywhere else. Well, folks, I think I'm gonna end it right here. If you have any other wacky, crazy games for me to play anywhere on this segment or in the sanctity of my own home, tweet me at ZTV Goofing Off with that hashtag, Drew's Mysterious Disc. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time when I do something completely different. See you later, guys.